Oh boy, coffee's ready. Having uh, coffee with uh, more of this <laughs> cosmic brownie cereal. I don't think I ever um, talked about it on the vlog. It was just on breakfast stream, but yeah. Little Debbie made even more cereals for some reason. Hello everyone and welcome to Friday. Um, it's a nice day. It's a nice day outside. Um, the high today is 75, uh, I think, yeah. which is fantastic. So uh, we actually, for the first time in a while, uh, have the windows open. So the windows are open, they're screened in. Kep was just sitting there um, just a few minutes ago. He was really enjoying that. We're having some cereal, some coffee, and uh, gonna try and get a little work done until dinner where we're making yet another soup. We were actually, mushroom soup. mushroom soup. We were gonna be making the soup yesterday and then we ended up not doing it, doing something else. So we're gonna do mushroom soup today. And then of course the continuation of Luigi's Mansion, uh, which I'm excited about. We moved so quickly last week. And it's not even that we specifically are moving quickly. It's that the game is shorter than I anticipated. That I'm really not sure where we're gonna wind up this week. No idea. I guess we'll, you know, We'll cross that bridge when we get there. So a few hours later in a little update, we've spent the last, God, hour? Hour. We spent the last hour working on this uh, mushroom soup. Uh, specifically, this is a potato and mushroom soup. It smells and looks really good. The potatoes aren't even in yet. And the potatoes aren't even in and it looks good. I also just really love mushroom soup. Um, I know it's not for everybody. Some people just do not like mushrooms, I understand. Um, it's also very rich. Mushroom soups are always very, very rich. I like that. You can't eat a ton of it all at once, but um, I've always really enjoyed it. So uh, yeah, this has been, it's been a long hour. I've been washing mushrooms and peeling potatoes and there's also thyme in there. Mouse currently chopping the potatoes and as soon as those are done, those are going in. And then we've got what, about 20 minutes? Yeah. I'm excited. And I'm also very ready to enjoy the fruits of our labor. I hope it's good. <laughs> you had to add a little garnish on top? A little top. bit. There's a little extra time that I cut. It looks amazing. It's good. It does need a little salt and pepper, but it's, um, it's tasty. It's, it's so hard to judge because like the recipe called for unsalted butter. Yeah. Which I don't buy unless I'm baking. Sure. So I was like, well, I'll just use a little salt and then we can always add more. It's not the creamiest soup, mushroom soup I've ever had, because I've had some mushroom soups that are like, I don't want to say that they're like milk. Yeah. But they're like really, really thick. This one's kind of kind of half and half. It's kind of a, like it's creamy, but it's also a little brothy. But I like mushrooms and also potatoes. I think most people like potatoes. Maybe you can't get everyone on the mushroom train. I sent a photo to my but. dad and I was like, I'm making mushroom chowder. And Rhonda was like, gross. And he said, what she said. <laughs> They're missing out. Mm. They're missing out. Are you a good boy? Yeah. Oh, he's so sweet. Oh, he's such a good cat. Yeah. Yeah. I would have grabbed my camera instead of using my phone to end the vlog, but the cat's on me and I didn't want to, I didn't want to move him. I'm sure now that I've, I've done that, I've said that he's going to get up, but whatever, it's fine. Um, so, uh, I wanted to talk again about that soup. It was real good. He's getting up, isn't he? He's getting up. Of course he is. It's fine. I'm still not going to switch. Um, I wanted to talk again about that soup. That soup was great. I ended up adding a little more salt and pepper to it. Um, but once it was properly uh, properly seasoned, it was really good. And also, I just really love mushroom soup. It was really, really nice. Um, we played more Luigi's Mansion. And now, I don't know if you're as surprised as I was about how far we got. Yeah, we are very far. Like, there's not much. It's short. It's such a short game. Like, whenever I was looking at how long it was going to take to beat, basically what I did, I was like, okay, it'll take three weeks, maybe four weeks. And if things go really badly, cause I'm always trying to think like if things go really badly, or even if it's not badly, even if it's like, for whatever reason, uh, 
you know, there's a lot of alerts or uh, breaks go really long for, for some reason, like maybe five weeks. And I was off by a lot because now at the end of week two, we have, I mean, we've beaten most of it. Yeah. Like, we don't have a whole lot left to do, apparently, and everyone's like, yeah, you probably got, like, two episodes <laughs> left or something, so um, now, we, now we have to plan for that, which is actually kind of interesting. So next week, we will certainly wrap up Luigi's Mansion, and uh, it probably won't take the whole stream length, so we'll probably, um, it'll probably be, like, Luigi's Mansion and then also something else. So we'll be doing a little something else. So that's exciting. Um, not exactly sure what yet, but we'll we'll figure it out. But it's been fun. You know, it's just, it's sad that it's so short in a way. I kind of wish there was more. But there is more because there's a second and third okay. game. So I guess maybe at some point we'll we'll play those. Uh, for now, we're going to get some sleep. We just, uh, we just had a snack. Um, we got to get some rest because we're actually doing another stream tomorrow. Uh, Nintendo sent over a copy of um, Sonic Colors Ultimate, uh, which is the Sonic Colors port for the Switch. Um, the game came out probably like two weeks ago or so. Got a lot of press, not necessarily great press, because there were some really like extreme visual bugs in the game. But uh, Sega was very aware of it and is like, oh crap, and has, from what I understand, patched most of like all of the the really crazy stuff out. So um, people really love Sonic Colors. Like it's a it's a game I never played, but it's um, you know a well loved Sonic title because there's a lot of Sonic games. Some of them have not <laughs> were not as well received as others, but Sonic Colors actually was. People really liked it. So um, I'm looking forward to getting a chance to try it out tomorrow. And then also we'll get to you know we're experiencing live you know what the game is like now a few weeks after release. Now that Sega's had time to do patches and stuff and, and see exactly how it performs. So we will find that out tomorrow live. And I'm looking forward to it because it's supposed to be really good. I think also it has good music. Well, all Sonic games have good music. Yeah. It's like a rule. <laughs> like even if the Sonic game is bad and the game is like, uh, this game's bad, the music's always great. So I, the music will probably be fantastic. Okay, that's it. Thanks for watching. Let's meet back tomorrow, shall we?